Okay, what's going on YouTube? So today I'm going to show you how to get a controller overlay like the one shown on the screen in your OBS screen recordings. First of all, you're going to want go to, to gamepadviewer.com. So from here, make sure your PS4 or Xbox controller is connected to your computer, either wire or Bluetooth, it doesn't matter your preference. So just type a few buttons and this will come up on the top. Just click a few buttons and move the joystick. Then click player one. And you, for me, I use a PS4 controller, so you can either do this one or the white. I'm gonna do the white because it has a better contrast. And then you need to go to info over here then go to the remap buttons so go to player one over here and then just what I do is just X out and you can change the background color but in OBS it won't really show but you can just do that if you want I just love how I'm green so you're gonna go to info generate URL after the after you did that then choose the skins mate I'm just doing that double checking and once you like everything just click on the this link and it should be automatically copied okay so now that you have gotten the link you're going to add it go to obs and go to your scene and add a scene and you can name whatever you want i'm just going to name mine control and then, what most other tutorials I saw, they didn't say, they didn't show this, but you should add a display capture or a screen capture, I believe, so that, yeah, window capture, so that you can actually see the screen. Because in previous tutorials, you can you just see the controller, but you can't even see what you're recording. So you should do this first, and then make sure to do this before you do the controller, otherwise it'll be on top of it. So now, you're going to click Add, then go to Browser. So now from here... I'm just going to name mine controller again. And then where it says URL, instead of this OBS project browser source, you're going to have to change that and paste that link that was from the, the website. Now you can change the width and height if you want, but that's not very necessary because you can just move it over here. Well, it says disconnected, but just press a button and it'll pop up. And you can see, we're now moving the sticks, and it's showing. If you see any delay, just try fixing your settings and changing that. So, now it'll be on the side, and you can make it bigger, smaller. Then, from there... You just start recording, but now I'm recording to show you the recording. So, I'll just put in a, an example on screen right now. Okay, so right now, I am playing some Rocket League. Let me turn down my volume. So, you can see the controller overlay, and it'll show all the buttons that I'm using whenever I'm playing. So, yeah, that's it for the tutorial. And, hope you liked it. Make sure to like and subscribe, and I'll see you next time.